Welcome back to Luxury Lane. Today we are diving into one of the most futuristic, most powerful, and most controversial warships ever created by the United States Navy, the USS Zumwalt DDG-1000. This isn't just a ship. This is a floating piece of advanced engineering, a stealth destroyer born to redefine naval warfare with a design that looks like it came straight out of a science fiction movie. And today, we are going to explore every detail you've always wanted to know, from the exterior and interior to its unmatched performance, advanced systems, and even its total cost. So sit tight, because this is going to be one of the most fascinating deep dives on this channel. The first thing that strikes you the moment you see the USS Zumwalt is the shape. It doesn't look like a typical destroyer. It has this sharp, angular, pyramid-style design that instantly tells you this ship was built for stealth. The Navy calls this a tumble home hull, which means the structure slopes inward instead of outward like traditional ships. The result is a warship that reflects radar waves away from the source, making this 610-foot giant appear on radar like a small fishing boat. From a technology and design point of view, that alone is incredible. You are looking at one of the largest destroyers the US. Navy has ever built, yet one of the hardest to detect. Even the materials used on the exterior are chosen with stealth in mind. The hull is coated with radar absorbent materials that help reduce its signature even further. The superstructure is built with composite materials rather than traditional steel, reducing not only weight but vibrations and heat emissions. And if you look at the edges, you'll notice nearly no exposed equipment. Everything is sealed behind smooth surfaces, whether it's antennas, communication domes, or weapon systems. The idea was simple, create a ship that blends into the horizon and avoids detection until it's too late. The signature wave piercing bow is another masterpiece. Traditional destroyers lift above waves, but the Zumwalt cuts through them. This gives it a smoother ride in rough seas, reduces splashing, and again prevents radar detection caused by the water being thrown around. Watching this ship slice through the ocean looks almost unreal, like it's gliding rather than sailing. Moving to the overall visual impression, the ship looks extremely clean and minimalistic. There are no huge masts, no exposed lifeboats, no open railings, it's all sealed and flat. This gives it a futuristic silence, an engineered aggression that stands apart from any warship on Earth. And that is why many people believe the Zumwalt will influence warship design for decades. Now let's step inside this engineering marvel. The interior of the USS Zumwalt is just as futuristic as the outside. The ship features some of the most advanced automated systems ever seen on a naval vessel. Because of this automation, the Zumwalt only needs around 147 crew members, which is unbelievable considering that traditional destroyers often require 250 to 300 sailors. This means the ship had to be designed to provide more comfort and more personal space to the crew than older vessels. Once inside, you notice the difference immediately. The lighting is modern and soft, the corridors are wider, and there's a cleaner, almost aircraft-like interior layout. Because the crew is smaller, each sailor gets better living quarters. The Navy put significant emphasis on comfort to reduce fatigue during long missions. Cabins feel more like small rooms instead of narrow bunks. The dining area, gym, and meeting rooms are more spacious than what you would expect in a destroyer. The command center, or combat information center, is the heart of this ship. And this place, looks straight out of a movie. You have giant digital screens, multifunctional touch displays, advanced radar visualizations, and real-time tracking systems. Every operator sits in a sleek, futuristic workstation that looks closer to a high-tech control center than a naval bridge. Everything is built around digital interfaces rather than analog switches. The Navy wanted a ship that could respond instantly, analyze threats automatically, and integrate with the broader U.S. military network without delay. The bridge is equally cutting edge. Instead of traditional ship controls, the Zumwalt uses joystick-style systems and digital navigation panels. The ship can be controlled from multiple locations, and the crew can reroute controls instantly if needed. It is one of the most technologically advanced naval environments ever created. Now let's move into what makes this destroyer truly legendary, its performance and weapon capabilities. The Zumwalt isn't just stealthy. It is also incredibly powerful. It runs on an integrated power system that generates nearly 78 megawatts of electricity. That is enough to power a small town. 
The reason for this enormous power generation is simple. The Navy built the Zumwalt to eventually support futuristic weapons like electromagnetic railguns and high-energy lasers. While these weapons are still being tested, the Zumwalt was built with the capacity to handle them from day one. But even without the future upgrades, the Zumwalt is deadly. The ship is equipped with two 155mm advanced gun systems designed to fire long-range guided ammunition. These guns were originally supposed to hit targets over 60 miles away with surgical precision. However, the ammunition became too expensive and was cancelled, which limited the weapon's usefulness. Despite this, the Zumwalt still carries a wide variety of missiles stored inside 80 advanced vertical launch cells. These cells can deploy Tomahawk cruise missiles, anti-air missiles, anti-ship weapons, and even future hypersonic missiles. Its anti-submarine capabilities are powerful as well. The Zumwalt carries advanced sonar systems and torpedoes, making it extremely dangerous below the surface. Combine this with its stealth profile, and you have a destroyer that can approach enemy waters without being detected, strike suddenly, and disappear into the ocean fog. The ship also carries two Mega Henry's minus 60 helicopters or one helicopter and a drone combination. These aircraft add more range, more surveillance, and more strike options to the already powerful Zumwalt. The propulsion system is another area where this destroyer stands out. The ship uses electric propulsion powered by gas turbines, giving it a quiet ride and reducing the noise that submarines can detect. Its top speed is around 30 knots, which is impressive for a ship of this size. But the real advantage is efficiency and stability, allowing the Zumwalt to travel long distances without frequent refueling. Of course, all of this advanced engineering came with a massive price tag. The cost of building the USS Zumwalt DDG-1000 is staggering. Each ship cost over $4.2 billion to build, and if you include research and development, the total program cost jumps closer to $22 billion for the entire class. Originally the Navy wanted 32 Zumwalt-class destroyers, then reduced it to 7, and finally ended up with only 3. The cost was simply too high, and some of the planned weapon systems were never fully completed. Still, despite the expenses, the Zumwalt remains one of the most advanced destroyers on Earth and plays a crucial role in pushing naval technology forward. The overall value of the Zumwalt is not just in its weapons or stealth design. It represents a future vision. Its electrical power system is unmatched, its automation reduces human risk, its sensors outperform older systems, and its radar signature is so low that enemy forces might detect a small boat instead of a massive destroyer. It is a platform built for new types of warfare where technology, stealth, and long-range precision matter more than size or brute force. As we wrap things up, the USS Zumwalt DDG-1000 stands as one of the most impressive engineering achievements of the United States Navy. It challenges traditional warship design, introduces new technology, and opens the door for advanced weapons systems that will shape the future of naval combat. Whether you see it as an expensive experiment or a bold leap forward, there's no denying that the Zumwalt is one of the most unique and powerful destroyers ever created. Outro. Thanks for watching Luxury Lane. If you enjoyed this deep dive into one of America's most advanced naval warships, make sure you subscribe for more detailed reviews, more futuristic tech explorations, and more USA-focused defense content.